along on our post-election day coverage, talking with some of the folks uh, from uh, election night. And one of those is Eric Halsorder, who was uh, intent on becoming the next auditor of the state. That will not happen now. As he lost last night, he joins us via telephone. Eric, good morning to you. Hey, good morning, gentlemen. How are you guys doing this morning? We're doing well. Your uh, your take on the results of last night and uh, how much of an effect do you think that Trisha Jackson had on the outcome of this race, Eric? Well, obviously, nobody likes to lose. I mean, but, you know, I've always felt that uh, I've been very great. I'm forever, forever grateful to the citizens of Berkeley County. I mean, they sent me to Charleston seven times. So I've represented Berkeley County for the last 14 years. And I just can't thank people enough for giving me that opportunity. Uh, obviously, my race, uh, I came up short last night. Um, I came in second, losing by about 26,000 votes. But uh, life goes on. I mean, I, I did put a little post out there uh, last night on Facebook suggesting that, hey, this is not the end. It's just the beginning. So if there's a silver lining in running for statewide office, it's a lot of work. But I did gain a little name recognition last night. So all in all, I was really focused and counting on a win, but I just I came up short. So Eric, Eric, you mentioned Berkeley County. There's certainly a love affair with you in Berkeley County because last night, eighty percent of the Berkeley Countyans voted for you. That's a that's yeah. a large number. Yeah, and uh, I, like I said, I'm forever grateful to the citizens of Berkeley County. I mean, they came out, and uh, I just didn't perform very well in certain counties, even the counties that I was targeting. I was coming in second and third, but uh, it was very difficult there towards the end when uh, Mark started gaining ground on me um, and then passed me. You know, next thing I know, I'm, I'm 8,000 behind. Next thing you know, I'm 16,000 behind, and there's 50% reported, 60% is climbing. It's just an insurmountable odd, odds when, it, you know, when that happens. But uh, I saw the writing on the wall, and I thought, well, there's nothing more I could do. Uh, I did the best that I could. I, I have no regrets. I know people try to second guess, well, you could have did this or you could have did that. But no, I mean, I, I had a strategy. My strategy was to advertise in 40 statewide newspapers, and I did that for six weeks. My strategy was also to advertise on their electronic editions for those who aren't getting a newspaper delivered. And then I focused on digital. I decided not to do any direct mail because I knew people would be inundated with uh, direct mail pieces. So I focused on 25 counties and 93,000 voters, and I hit them with uh, digital direct mail, basically. But uh, anyways, overall, I mean, look, I, like I said, nobody wants to lose, but unfortunately I came up short last night. Eric, this is John. <coughs> Excuse me, this yeah, is John. John. I feel like you just threw out a big hint of uh, – something new coming in uh, there could be yes absolutely you know that's what i said it's not the end it's just the beginning oh. i'm going to survey everything that's uh that's before me and uh this is not the end of uh hearing my name out there so uh just uh keep your ears peeled and and your eyes open and uh we'll see what becomes of it that's as far as you're going to go no extra hint <laughs> would, eric would you take a a uh a morris if morrissey is the next governor cabinet post if offered well, there's always opportunities out there, and that's what I'm suggesting. Uh, so we'll have to wait and see uh, where those opportunities lie. But, uh, hey, for that matter, I could run for uh, another office. You know what I mean? So the opportunities are out there. I did gain, like I said, a, a little bit of statewide name recognition last night. And don't forget the opponent who beat me had ran for two previous statewide races. So, you know. It mm -hmm. just takes a little time. All right. Well, th hey, Eric, thanks. Appreciate all the yep. access over the years and yep, uh, also all the HVAC work. Yep. We'll see you guys later. Remember, I'm still a delegate until uh, December. So Absolutely. if you need me on anytime, just give me a holler. Okay. All thanks, right. Eric. Take care, Eric. See you guys. Bye.